Okay, then here we have 31-year-old Asan Oadrago, who, as you can see, is now at Bayern Munich. He starts the game out at Schalke 04 as a 16-year-old. And as we look through his history, you can see he's had some really, really good seasons. Uh, played for about five or six seasons with Schalke, then secured a £44.5 million move to Bayer Leverkusen, where he performed really well, and then secured £59 million move to FC Bayern uh, in 2027. And he's been there for the last 10 years years and his seasons have all been incredible a 7.74 average rating in the 34-35 season is his best uh, but he's been consistently in the mid to high sevens throughout his whole career and if we have a look at his biography we can see what he has won across his career uh, and it's been a pretty stellar impressive career at that he was named the nxgn uh, winner twice if we look here back to back in 24 25 25 26 pipping out a lot of really good young players to back to back a lot of new gens in there as well back to back victories for Asan in that ranking 18 and 19 years of age now what else has he won since being that he's also been a uh, European golden boy we can see there as well he's won lots of personal awards we'll have a keep looking through the personal awards as well and then we go to what he's won at a club level uh, if we can see here uh, we can see he's won the Ballon d'Or which is pretty impressive you can see there 34 35 that was one of his impressive that's a 7.72 average rating season that one at 29 years old for FC Bayern a fantastic season there uh, he won gold 50 so well, here's the European golden boy actually whilst we're here 2025 a 19 year old back when he was at Leverkusen uh, still racking up the awards uh, goal 50 he won that in the same 34-35 season as well a great season there uh, countless countless personal awards uh, but at club level uh, he's won the DFB Pokal four times UEFA Super Cup a time or two uh, two Bayern uh, Champions League victories uh, and the Bundesliga eight times throughout his time at FC Bayern. As you can see here, they've not won every single Bundesliga title because uh, RB Leipzig have won a few as well. Uh, but he's won eight in his time since joining uh, FC Bayern. Obviously, didn't win anything at a domestic level for Leverkusen or Schalke. Right, what we're going to do now is we're going to look back to what he was like at the beginning of the game and compare and contrast and see how he's developed over these 15 seasons. So you can see uh, his physicals have gone uh, from this low point here and basically upped across the board really nicely. Same can be said about his mentals as well. They've really rounded out. Uh, his technicals currently aren't groundbreaking and they weren't at the beginning of the game as a 16-year-old either. Uh, but it's his dribbling, his passing, his technique passing in nicely with that uh, vision and determination off the ball sort of skill set in the centre of the park as we flip back to today obviously the 15 years into the future you can see why he's developed into such a really really good player uh, all of these attributes aren't groundbreaking you can see his technicals nothing above 15 at 31 years of age but he's definitely a very well-rounded player uh, he's not even described as an elite midfielder he's just a midfielder plenty of good player traits as well but his career has really shown that you don't need the best attributes to get the best out of really good players he's got a 7.7 .7 average rating for a season his career average rating across the whole 15 years is 7.34 and that includes time at Schalke uh, Bayer Leverkusen and FC Bayern all his career spent in the Bundesliga he's got plenty of international caps as well such a really good career he's played 131 times for Germany you can't really go like that if you're not a good player and that is the career of Asan Oadrago let us know in the comments how he's done in your save whether you've signed him and we'll see you on the next video